All right, hey everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Pokemon White 2 Randomizer Nuzlocke, where every day we struggle not to say Pokemon Ultra Moon Randomizer Nuzlocke here on the channel. And today, as promised, everybody's level 18. I went to that uh, Doubles Grass and I leveled up Triple T and Tina in it with some uh, some pretty scary enemies. We had some Dunsparce that knew Rollout, pretty scary uh, also, there was an, a fracture that popped up on the last one for Tina to get her 18th level. That was pretty scary, too. As so we take a sip of a beverage. Actually, let's finish this beverage off. Hold on. Hmm. Take a sip of that, finish it off. And uh, Tina now knows Rapid Spin. So we've got the Rapid Spinner up on the team. And Triple T knows Fury. Uh, Fury Attack. I think it's Fury Attack. It's not Fury Cutter, but it's Fury Attack. It's one where you hit two to five times. So we are, I think, okay-ish to go ahead and challenge the rest of at least the next person in Roxy's gym. I'm leading with Madam, and I've equipped a Flying Gem and a Poison Gem to Triple T and Madam, respectively, to enhance their abilities. Oh, oh, did you lose your, uh, your pep and your rock, buddy? Because uh, I kind of destroyed your team, huh? So let's challenge your bass player. I can always be straight and honest with myself whenever I'm playing the guitar or having a Pokemon battle. Oh, I guess she's got a guitar. Unless she recalls her bass guitar a guitar, but... Psh, psh, whatever. Oh, yeah, no, she's got a guitar. Developer Noel. <laughs> I wonder what their real names are, but I like her design. It's cute with the big ponytail and the, and the skirt. Sending out ha ha pip hop hip gonna die. Oh, yeah, level 18s versus level 14s. I think we're good on this one. I think we're good on this one, Chief. We could Poison Sting, but I'm trying to save that... Uh, that poison gem for if we need it against the gym leader. Haha, <laughs> how about you poison pointed? Oh, no, no poison point. Oh, well. <sighs> so, yeah, it's a, well, it's not a new day, but I've been grinding for 30 minutes. Uh, I boosted up the, the frames a bit, so I was going at four times speed to make it quicker. So, I've been grinding for 30 minutes at a four times speed, so you can imagine what that would have been like had I not had that. So, Vibrava, that's another bug Pokemon, so I'm going to keep battling. Yeah, oh, this guy. Does he go into Flygon? Does this go into Flygon? I forget. A lot of stuff from Gen 3 I'm very iffy on because I just don't know. Huh, is he Rock? Bug? Oh. I became trapped in Sand Tomb. Uh-oh. This ain't good. Uh, can I switch out when I'm in Sand Tomb? I don't think I can, can I? Uh, uh-oh. None of my characters are really good against this. Uh, bug flying. Oh, Jesus. Probably best would be Triple T then. Yeah, can't be switched out. Oh, Jesus. Oh, this ain't good. This might be the end for Madam. It totally might be. Just 100% might be. Let's see. Double kick, focus energy, poison sting. Uh, rock wouldn't be doing anything. Pack double kick then. Come on, double kick. Gotta work it. No. No. Oh, good sand attack. Oof. I was worried about another sand tomb. Oh Jesus! I mean, the uh, you know the, the the damage between turns ain't that bad. You know, not, it's not, not gonna lie, it ain't, ain't gonna be that good. Well, if we miss, that's what's gonna be real bad. Hoof! No misses. Oh, thank the Jeebus! Thank the praising of the Jeebus! And a level 19, Madame. Oh, so good. All them stats too. Those delicious developer Noel, get out of here, Noel. You're not pear, Noel. I, I keep hearing Pokemon every time she sings that song. It's like P K M N Pokemon. I think that's what she's saying. It's hard to hard to tell because it's all bit crushed, all compressed for the file for the th not the 3ds but the DS. And I've been seeing some of the tweets and some of the screen caps from Sword and Shield. That are getting people a little, uh, <laughs> uh, because I guess they're not really enjoying the quality of the ge the, the shots that are on right now. Oh, I've been pressing the A button and B button opposite, so I probably shouldn't be doing that. So some people have been seeing that, uh, some of the things with, like, the giant Onyx or Steelix or whatever is, like, really bad. And some of the places look like Ocarina of Time level detail. And, you know what, I don't know how to feel because I want to give them the benefit of the doubt that, like... They're just using placeholder assets right now, 
as companies often do before official release, because that's all like E3 footage, right? That they're complaining about now. And that's stuff that's like, that's all like pre-selected stuff of what they've got done month, like months in advance. Like that stuff that they think is like brand new for E3 isn't, that's not even like remotely new. That's months old usually. Uh, cause a lot of times when they scrap together stuff like too quickly, that's when you get the conferences that have bugs and like terrible things happening in them. But, uh, let's go ahead and get ready. I'm going to no knock some sense out of you. I was going to say rock or knock. I think it'd be cool for n rock some sense out of you. Wayne. <laughs> I like Roxy though. I like her style. I like her sweater. It's a good one. Bug catcher Wayne sent out frillish. Ooh, psychic water. All right. So yeah, there's just a lot of stuff that's been happening with the, the Sword and Shield announcements. And uh, so let's see, Psychic Water, which means none of this is going to be effective. But we could try focusing energy and then try and get some crits. I want to be, I want to be hopeful, I want to be optimistic. But... It's hard to say. I mean, it's Game Freak and it's Nintendo, so I'm always going to have, like... It, I know it's not that effective, but I was hoping for maybe the poison gem might cause an auto poison. Nope. All right, we're getting out of here. We're getting out of here. I also forgot that Psychic is strong against poison, which I'm very upset. So let's see. Water? Psychic. So Tina would be best, possibly? So yeah, I'm, I'm hoping that Game Freak and Nintendo pull it out and are able to make it good, but there is... I'll, I'll wait to see closer to launch what stuff looks like. Owie cheap hoochies. Uh, I guess I'll just bug bite, see what happens. Oh, it's not bubble, it's bubble beam. That's why it's so strong. Hi, chi chai, chi mai, chi ha, cheese. Do you got a berry? Hopefully you got a berry. It's not very effective. Oh, because bug and water. Oh, no. Oh, no. All right, so I need to... This ain't going to be good either. Because triple T... Triple T ain't good against water either. Bubble beam! I mean, not good against water, but special defense, really. Why'd you have to go? Why'd you have to leave me when I needed you the most? And a critical hit by Triple T in the morning. Well, this uh, certainly ended well. Yes, we just got to go with Peck. And hope for the best. And a bubble beam. Hooray. This ain't looking good. And he used the super potion. Oh, wonderful. And do I have, like, X special defend? No, I do not. I do not have X special defend. Uh, I guess I could use a fresh water. I'm thinking that this might be the uh, the place where it all goes down. Let's fight. Double kick, maybe. It's not going to be that good because it's psychic. Oh, it doesn't affect the frillish. Why doesn't it affect the frillish? Fighting. Wait, is this ghost? Wait, is this ghost? I thought it was psychic. It's ghost, isn't it? Oh, damn. It's Ghost water. I'll have to look that up. If I don't get killed by this dang bubble beam. Uh, we could risk the biscuit and hopefully get that peck. If not, it's game over for madam. Uh, and game over for madam. <gasps> not game over. Not game over. Y'all don't know garbage. I'm going to give that fresh water because I'm not risking this. Not one bit. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Stop using Bubble Beam. I hate you. All right. So it's it's immune to fighting, which means it's got to be Ghost. 100% got to be Ghost. There you go. We took out the Frillish. Oh, not even going to get a ton of experience for that either. Send in Mawile. 
that is steel dark. So we should be good to double kick this into oblivion. And there goes the intimidate. Wonderful. Why did it have to have good Pokemon? Oh, come on, double kick. End this. Oh, Jesus, Murphy. Get poisoned. Wait, it can't get poisoned. It's steel type. Uh, dang it. All right, hold on. Oh, Jesus, Murphy. This isn't going to be good, and it's just going to keep biting. Yep. Oh, I don't have counter on him. I was going to say, what if I use counter? Ah, uh, No. Actually, that might be a good idea. What if I use counter on Tina? But I would have to heal up Tina first, because Tina's not doing well, because she's very low. So what if I tried that? What if I super potioned Tina? Because Tina should be fine to survive a bite, right? Yeah. Yeah, because dark isn't going to hurt Tina. Oh, but steel could, though. Oh, gosh darn it. I'm just going to have to stick it out with... Uh, with Madam, aren't I? Oh, this is, this is where everything goes bad. We need crits. We need crits. Come on, Madam. We need crits. Yeah, use bite. Yeah, I get it. This could win or it couldn't. But we're fine if it tries to bite us again, though. Come on, crit. Crit, 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 crit. Oh, no, we're good. We're good. Oh, my lord. We only lost triple T. Oh, my god. Screw you, Bug Catcher Wayne. I hate you. In the middle of your course? Good. I hope you die. <laughs> we... oh, sigh. What are you going to lose, Roxy? Or what are you doing losing, Roxy? Well, I guess that means you're strong. This stinks. But I have to give everything I had, and I feel revitalized and refreshed now. I'm so shook. I'm shooketh. Here. Proof that you beat me. Yay. And on the screen, we got the poison or the toxic badge. I think it's the toxic badge. It's the goo badge. The gooey boys. That's what I call my mucks. Receive the toxic badge from Roxy. Two badges. Now Pokemon up to level 30. Even Pokemon you got in trades will realize how good you are and won't ignore your commands. Also, here's Yuzu's TM. Oh, cool. We got Ember. Nice. But that would have been good for a Pokemon that's got special attack. But we don't. It's Venoshock. No, it's not. Sorry. Not going to get Venoshock, even though Venoshock is one of my favorite moves. Oh, don't you even. Don't even... Hey you! I felt like you were something special during the battle with Roxy. Please come to, with me to Pokemon Studios. Pokestar Studios. And yet, wow, you're going to Pokestar Studios? <laughs> wow, I can't believe I called that dialogue. Oh, I forgot, the old man, I have to get back into work as captain. Uh, my dad! My dad! Oh, but now we have to go put Triple T in the stupid box with the stupid stupids, because criticals. Ugh. I think that critical actually worked out for the best, though, to be honest. Because we weren't going to do well against that Frillish, who's probably ghost water. Stupid ghost. Jellyfish. Stupid ghosts. <sighs> we'll talk to the, the metal guy as well, see what kind of garbage he wants to sell us. Yeah, back to full health. I got you. Hope to see you again. What do you want to sell me? Waiting for you. Here's a new medal. It's probably going to be like a gym badge medal or something. A non-effective artist metal. Oh. So I guess that uh, means I tried to use attacks that weren't effective. Alright. Perfect way to, you know, rub it in, game. Alright, so here we go. Poke Heaven, no. I'm gonna go to Pokemon. You know what? Let's just take the uh, held item. Take the flying gem first. And then we'll move little Triple T into Poke Heaven. But still, our Nidorino and our Pineco. Our Poison and our Bug still going strong. <sighs> I love Bug Poison, but for whatever reason, when I do these runs, I seem to get stuck with, like, the same few types, and I never get anything, like, outside of that. And then if I do, it, like, dies immediately. So now we commemorate everything with a save. And hopefully the next time we go to a new city and a new route, we can find a new friend. Which hopefully we will do. Right now. Because we've still got, uh, still got a few bits in the episode, I think. Actually, let's see here now. Yeah, we got a few bits in the episode. 
because uh, I've been I let the recording run during the grinding, just so I could keep track of the time. Can uh, actually anybody learn Ember just for funsies? Let's see if anyone can learn Ember. I doubt they can, but you never know. Tina can learn Ember. Holy Jesus! Which move should be forgotten? Uh, probably counter. Jeez, we don't need counter. We need Ember. And we've always got. We can always relearn counter if we so wish. Tina learned Ember. Now Tina's got that sweet fire attack. We've got a little bit extra coverage, you guys. Not that it means anything. Uh -huh. I see that kid sounds promising. Indeed, this kid should be here any moment. Oh, right here, they beat up Roxy. Look who should appear, Pokemon Studios. Hey, Usagi, we've been waiting for you. This is our boss, Mr. Stu Dio. Uh, wow. That's a great name, Mr. Stu Dio. Like, I care about what you have to say. I'm sorry, darling. Could you wait an insy moment? Eh, I don't want to read these. what these guys have to say. Marvelous. They're amazing. Because the studios inspires the people around the world, Usagi. Charms. Minute. Wait. Things are happening. <laughs> That's my boss for you. What graceful footwork. Well then, Usagi, come with me. Yep. I wonder what we do here. Oh, is this the Pokemon contests? Or what is this place? This is new to number two, isn't it? White two? First, let me tell you briefly what Pokestar Studios is all about. Built for making films. Oh, right. It's this... Stupid filmmaking thing. Where you can go and, like, make weird little trainer clips and films about battles and such. Alright, well, this is going to take a few minutes to burn through, so thank you all for joining me on this episode of Pokemon White 2 Randomizer Nuzlocke, where today we have to say goodbye to another dear friend, but we'll catch more on the routes to come. But until then, we're going to follow this little dude around, and he's going to tell us all about a bunch of stuff. And that's going to be about it. So thank you all for joining me. And until next time, take care, everybody.